All right, you guys aren't ever allowed to say that I don't deliver on bets. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, my name's GVay99. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today, I'm gonna go and eat a sock. So last night, TSM were playing Renegades in the North American LCS, and I was watching the game. I was thinking, you know, this game is probably gonna be a stomp, right? And so I tweeted this. If Renegades manages to beat TSM, then I'll eat a sock on YouTube. And today, I'm a man of my word. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, and eat a sock. I'm thinking of some more stuff I can say in this intro, but I guess I shouldn't put this off anymore. Let's go ahead and I guess teach you guys how to eat a sock. So eating a sock is kind of tricky because you can't just eat a whole sock. I'm pretty sure you cannot digest whatever socks are made of, polyester or cotton. I'm pretty sure human beings were not supposed to be eating socks. So we have a few things that we're gonna do to hopefully make this actually edible. Uh, we have some mushrooms that we're gonna cook. This is a snack I like to make all the time. I uh, fry mushrooms with garlic and olive oil. I figured if we cut up the sock and add it to my usual little recipe, then uh, hopefully all this will be pretty not that bad. Choosing the right sock is probably pretty important if you're gonna eat a sock. This one is a sock that I'm not gonna miss. It's already got plenty of holes in it. It's pretty worn. I made sure I washed it and everything. So hopefully this won't be that disgusting. But anyway, let's get started. All right, so that seems like a pretty good amount of sock meat. We actually still have probably more than half a sock left over here, but if we cut up too much more, then we're probably gonna have more sock than mushrooms, and I, I wanna make sure I can actually eat this. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and start frying up the sock a little bit, mix it with some vegetable oil, and cut up the garlic. garlic. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but the sock is starting to sizzle. And then we add the mushrooms and cook them until they're a nice, almost golden brown. Look at that sizzle. That is not the tastiest looking sock I've ever made. All right, I wanna show you guys here, there's nothing left in the pan. It's all on the plate. So let's eat. Now when eating a sock, I would probably suggest pairing it with any sort of alcoholic drink since you're about to be eating a sock. Can't procrastinate any longer. Let's dig in. Not that bad. It doesn't go down smooth. Oh my god, I'm eating a sock. What am I doing with my life? Okay, so I didn't quite eat all of it. There's still a little on my plate. I'll, I'll just go ahead and show you. But I did eat almost all of it. it. It's a really hard thing to do. I'm not gonna lie here, okay? Okay, so tips for eating a sock. Make sure that you don't let it all clump up in your mouth. If you, like you instinctively chew it because you think it's food at first, or you sort of trick your brain into thinking it's food by mixing it with a bunch of food, but you can't actually chew it. You just have to swallow it like it's a pill or like it's gum or something. And you can't let it clump up in your mouth because then 
turns into this gigantic mess that's difficult to deal with. I still have a little bit on my plate here. The cooking it didn't really do that much to it. It did eliminate like any sort of bad flavor, but it still was a bitch to deal with. All in all, I would say like two out of 10 would never try again. And I'm never gonna make another stupid bet like this. This was the worst idea I've ever had. Then again though, I mean, that was a pretty small amount of sock for a meal. Like I still have a little more than half a sock left. I mean, I guess it's leftovers. But anyway, yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed watching today's very strange, weird video. I will see you all tomorrow in our next episode of Road to Diamond. But until then, thank you very much for watching. Good luck in solo queue, and have a wonderful day. Still have some stuck in my teeth.